Hey, how's it going? And welcome back to the channel and Skyrim. So, continuing to work our way through Solstheim, we've been to the Temple of Mirak. We met Freya and cleared out the temple, where we found the Black Book Waking, Waking Dreams. And Freya thinks it's important we tell her father about it. So this has started the quest, The Fate of the Scar. So let's crack on. Uh, Freya leads you down from the Temple of Mirak uh, down to the village, uh, where she'll introduce you to her father here. Okay, so we go so through a whole load of dialogue here. My magic grows weak, and so does the barrier around our village. Time is short. Tell me what you know. I've seen Mirak. Really? How? I read a book in Mirak's temple. I went somewhere where Mirak was there. Terrible battles fought at the temple. The dragons burning it to the ground in rage. They speak also of something worse than dragons buried within. Difficult to imagine, but if true, it means what I feared has come to pass. Mirak was never truly gone, and now has returned. If you could go to this place and see him, are you like Mirak? Are you dragonborn? I am indeed then Dragonborn. You are connected with him. The old tales say that he too was Dragonborn. What does it mean if we're both Dragonborn? I am unsure. It may mean that you could save us, or it may mean that you could bring about our destruction. But our time here is running out. The few of us left free of control cannot protect ourselves for much longer. You must go to Sering's watch. Learn there the word that Mirak learned long ago. Now, we've already been to Sering's watch, and uh, I went there by mistake. Um, I'll include a link to that uh, at the end of the video. the hold on all people there, and free them from control. Okay. Use a bend will on the shout and the stone. Okay, so we've already been to Sirian's Watch, got the uh, the word. Now there's uh, one of the standing stones here, has got a lot of scars slaving away over it. So there's Sirian's Watch if you want to go. Like I say, I'll include the link to that, but for now, we'll go to the windstone and rescue the skull. Okay, here we are. There's a standing stone. Now, what you've got to do is actually use the bend wheel shout on the stone. There you go. Now back off because what's going to come out is a lurker. And these guys can be quite tough. I'll make sure I get a sneak attack on him. There he is. Oh, I didn't get a sneak on him. And quite often the people working there will actually come to your aid once they've been released. Uh, make sure you search these guys because you can pick up some really good uh, uh, little bits and bobs from them. Okay, that's done. Let's head back to the village. And see old Storm. That was quick and easy, wasn't it? <laughs> okay. And go through a little bit of dialogue with him and it'll actually start up a, a very similar quest called Cleansing the Stones. I've decided to do them in two separate videos um, just so people can find them. An ally to the skull, and so the skull shall be allies to you. If you have released the windstone and broken the hole... Okay, we started Cleansing the Stones quest. Uh, I'll do that next video. Um, but also importantly, we become an ally to the Skull, so we shall get the access to the secrets of Starrim arm, um, armor uh, and weaponry, which uh, I'll be doing a video on very, very soon. That's going to be my end game armor. So there you go, the Skull are free. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. I uh, hope you found it useful. Please leave a comment and a like, and uh, later.
I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, leave a comment, and please do subscribe. If you'd like to see more videos like this, then push the bell next to the subscribe button after you subscribe, obviously. Later.